sugar. All right, well, I have nothing planned spectacular for today, so don't expect a lot. But I do have a few things that I wanted to do, and I just felt like picking up the camera, to be honest. I texted my husband earlier, and I said, I don't know what to vlog about, but I just want to vlog today. <laughs> so, I don't know what to expect. Um, I do have a few things that I need to get out and do before 1 o'clock, because at 1, I'm babysitting. So, I need to get all of this stuff done, and it's like 10.30. Baby son hasn't had a nap yet, and... I'm on, I was honestly waiting for my husband to, um, to call the bank, so it's a lot of stuff going on right now. But I think I'm going to go ahead and get out right now and, t and wait for him to call the bank. And while I'm out, I need to go get baby son some juice. And I think there was something else I needed to go get, so... Um, so anyways, I plan on getting out, and I thought I'd take y'all along throughout our day uh today's thursday so i don't know i know that my mom is supposed to come by later but again i don't really have a lot planned uh except i need and i mean need to clean out our pantry but i i, I just I, I i i i just don't know if i'm gonna get to that today <laughs> yeah Maybe I should take a nap with you. Can I take a nap with you? Hmm. Um, so, anyways, we're going to go do all of that good stuff and get out for a little bit. This guy's got some energy. I just got in I got done running all the errands that I was gonna run baby son fell asleep when we got to Walmart so I literally had to carry him around in the store which is fine because I didn't get to get my work in my work out in this morning so I mean this arm it's a beast it's a beast today <laughs> I literally carried him around for like 20 minutes in Walmart trying to pull basket at the same time Y'all know how it is. But it was really sweet because this lady who was putting up bread and stuff, she was like, 
oh that's so sweet and you should feel so proud as a mom because he is just so comfortable with you and he just loves you so much that he could just fall asleep amongst all this chaos and craziness and just be asleep in your arms and everything I don't know she said it way better than I did but the point that I'm trying to make it just it just made me feel good and I don't know it was like a little pat on the back um but anyways I, ha when I went to Walmart, I went to go get baby son some more juice, but then I remembered that I forgot that tomorrow I'm supposed to have a couple friends over and we're going to eat and we're just going to fellowship and we're just going to talk about Jesus and our life and all of those things. And so I was like, oh snap, I better go ahead and get the stuff for that because I never know what my day has in store for me. So to try to say, oh, I'll go tomorrow. I'll be rushed for time and something will happen and then I'll end up not even getting all the things I want to get. So anyways, <clears throat> I went ahead and got that stuff. I just got some stuff to make chicken alfredo and I got a salad and some stuff to make um, brownie fudge sundaes. So hopefully it turns out I'm going to try to make homemade noodles. I made that before in a long time ago. Like it's been months, probably last year actually. Yeah. Sometime last year, I had made homemade noodles for the very first time, and they turned out so good. My husband said that he prefers that over, like, any other noodles that he's ever tried. So, um, I'm going to try to show out and make me some homemade noodles for everybody. Uh, but anyways, baby son's asleep, and while he's asleep, I'm going to try to put up these groceries and start tackling some of this mess, and then hopefully, after... And then hopefully once he wakes up from his nap, then we can hang out and do some stuff and sit outside and just enjoy the day. It is gorgeous outside. Now, there is like an overcast and everything, but it's still, it feels great. Like, it's giving me all the springtime vibes and I'm like, come on, spring, come on. But uh, anyways, I'm going to go do that real quick and then hopefully clean up this kitchen because that's a wreck. Well, change of plans. I guess I'm going to hold baby son while I put up groceries. <laughs> it's okay. This is life. It's part of life. He's not going to be this age forever. So, I'm trying to soak it all in. But anyways, now I'm going to go put up groceries. <laughs> the deal I did not pick up the camera yesterday and I even debated on whether to just scrap the whole footage that you even saw previous of this because I was like really there was nothing to show for the day we didn't do anything but then I was like no because I already recorded it and I feel like do y'all ever feel like that like no I already recorded all this I'm not gonna just forget about it it's just gonna be awkward and weird and people are gonna like it <laughs> Or they can just skip forward to the parts that matter to them, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, I, I, I got food all in my teeth. <clears throat> what was I going to say? Anyways, <clears throat> today's Friday. We don't have very much planned today either. Except for, I told y'all that, I don't know. Yeah, I did tell y'all that. So, I told y'all that my friends are going to come over today. Y'all, I have friends, a couple of them, but not a lot. So let's, let, let me just keep it really real with y'all. And, um, anyway, so here in a little bit, I'm going to, if I could talk today, that would be great. But here in a little bit, I'm going to make some pasta and I actually, oh, uh, I don't want to go to the store again. I might just go to United though, but I forgot to get 
heavy whipping cream. So, I, I don't know. I, I have cream cheese in there, so I might just use that instead. But that's not the way I want to bake it. So, oh, the difficulties and challenges. This is why I wish that my kids could drive. <laughs> so, I can send them to the store. I'm ready for that seasonal life. If you have never had homemade pasta, let me just tell you, you are missing out. It is so simple to make. All you need is two and a half cups of flour, four eggs, one tablespoon of olive oil, and one teaspoon of salt. That's it.
right, definitely when you are rolling out your dough, make sure you have a good amount of flour down because if not, your dough is gonna stick to you, it's gonna stick to the surface and all of that. Make sure you have a generous amount. Now, I don't know if my dough was really sticky because I ended up leaving my dough out longer than the 30, 45 minute mark or if it was just because I didn't add enough flour in the beginning. So definitely if your dough is sticky, add some more flour, get that mixture to where it's not sticking to your hands or any of that. Well, on Saturday, we got to get out and enjoy some pretty weather, and I truly was not feeling it this day. I had to wrestle up some strength to even get up off the couch on this day because I'll be honest with y'all, I was not feeling good. My throat was hurting, my head was hurting, I just was not feeling it, but I decided for the kids that I would get up and get out and try to make the best of the day, and that's exactly what we did had a blast at the park that day.
much for stopping by and watching this video today. I really hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. And also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. We would love for you to join our family. And until next time, God bless y'all and go and be a light out there.